I think substance is this kind of psychological desire we have for there to be some some solid ground. And I think philosophically and scientifically, when we investigate that, the ground seems to disappear. The, you know, the, this idea that particles don't exist before you measure them is not is is the mainstream position. You know, it's not a fringe position. It's the kind of the idea of reality not being locally real is not some wacky, you know, it's Nobel Prize winning stuff. Um, but it's Don't an invitation. I think it's kind of strange that that only you can only make that assertion with some extremely intense measuring devices. <laughs> Whereas if I just go for a walk, like I'm definitely sure the ground is solid and it's going to matter, or like the bus is going to be solid if I step right. out in front of it, right? So reality is extremely locally real as far as I can tell. And and I don't have super colliders or anything like that, but I have a strong feeling that we can take any equation of quantum mechanics and give it a physical solution. That is that is possible. Both of these pieces are important in constructing a view of reality because if you just treat everybody like they're atoms, you're not going to have any friends and you're not going to get anywhere. But if you walk around without recognizing that atoms are a thing and you need to cooperate with them and treat them as if they're very real, uh, then you'll end up getting hit by a bus.